Hey, what's going on YouTube? I device help here. Today in this video, I wanted to share with you guys my favorite applications to watch movies and TV shows on. Now, the uh, the application is called Movie Box, and uh, it works the same way on iPhones and iPads. Supports iOS 6 and higher. Now, let's go ahead and get started. Now, for the iPad, when you go to Cydia to download it, you don't need to add any sources. Just go ahead and search in Cydia. Again, that is for the iPad. Now, for the iPhone users, uh, you have to go to the Manage tab. You got to hit the Edit and Add button. You're going to add a source. Which the source, like always, will be in the video description down below. Once you add the source, you can go to your search section here and search for Movie Box. So there you go. You can download it off that source that I'll have in the video description down below, which is the Insanely Eye source. Again, iPad users, you can just search it. Now, it's a great application because it's absolutely free. You don't have to pay for any downloads or the application itself. Uh, you get you know, when you first get through it here with the application, you get a search tab here on the top left to search individual movies. You also get a filter button so you can filter by alphabetical orders and things like that. You can browse through all the movies. Let's say you want to uh, watch uh, a movie. Uh, you can tap on the movie that you want to watch. You can um, add it to watch later, or you can uh, watch it right now. Uh, you can also download it, which is one of my favorite options. I can take it on the go. And also you can select the video quality. You can go from standard definition all the way to higher definition on every movie. And it's really, really great quality movies here. Uh, you can select from the selection. It's really, really, really nice. They have tons of movies in here, and they add more every day. Now, the same thing applies on the iPad. You can go ahead and tap on one of the movies. You can go ahead and search, even share, report any problems. Uh, and, of course... You can watch and download or watch later just like you can do on the iPhone goes for the iPad. Now here on the TV show section you also get a search tab. Uh, you also get a filter button. Uh, the same thing as in movies. You've got tons of TV shows here to select from. Uh, once again guys you can tab on a TV show. Uh, you can select the season and also the episode. You can select the season by tapping on here or you can select the episode. And then you can watch the episode on standard definition or high definition and uh, click download or watch now. Now all your downloads would go into uh, this my library uh, section here which you can search movies, TV shows or all your downloads at once. Uh, the same thing again goes for the iPad it's just the UI is a little different. The column section is on the left here and then you get that. Um, you can go here into news which uh, gives you information of all the new movies that have been uploaded to the application. Uh, again, same thing for the uh, TV shows. They update all these movies and TV shows on a daily basis. So this application is really, really, really nice, guys. I think you guys should really go check it out. Uh, it's called Movie Box. Uh, you can download and watch TV shows on your iOS device, iPads, and iPods. Uh, now, a quick note before I leave. If you have kids, you also might want to try checking out uh, Cartoon. Uh, this great application is for uh, cartoons. You can watch cartoons and TV shows, and it kind of works the same way. You can watch uh, a, a a special cartoon, um, and uh, you can have fun here and start watching cartoons. <laughs> so that is if you have kids. I uh, wanted to throw that one out there. But Movie Box, there you guys have it. I hope you guys enjoy this quick little video. Please thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Uh, I always do appreciate it when you thumbs up my video, guys. Make sure you leave a comment down below if you have any other questions on what I talked about in this video. And of course, don't forget to stay up to date with the latest information on your iOS device by going to iDeviceHelpUs.blogspot.com. It's been iDevice, and I will catch you guys on the next one. Peace.